could tell me what song is that from you'll be shout outed shout outed in the next video what's going on youtube it's shaq here and uh <coughs> i'm sick as hell uh voice crack uh yo so what we're gonna be doing is i'm gonna be showing you the best ways to warm up um this is like this is like not for like people that like have like 50 hours a day. If you got 50 hours that you could put in every day to play this game, then you might as well like just skip off the just do something else. But if you're like a person like me that only plays for like an average one to two hours a day, you know, you, you got a life, you know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna show you the best ways you can warm up, plus the best ways, like, the best maps to get better aim. Just basically get good from being a typical bronze Timmy to, like, a diamond, uh, Draymond. I don't know, I don't know like, I don't know, like, the Fortnite, there's Timmy, there's Tony, there's Ted, there's Todd, there's Bob, there's Philly, there's, I don't know what starts with D, there's, there's Draymond, Reed, like, I'm, all right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm too hyped for no reason. The first map that we're going to be doing is going to be practicing your a uh <laughs> The first map we're going to be doing is practicing your editing skills. So if you're like super new to edit, you know, you're like mostly a zero build player, that's fine. You just want to learn how to edit. So this map code will be in the description down below. You know, I'm not like one of those fiends who just don't do it. You know, I might put a Temu link down there, but like let's not worry about that. So if you're new to editing, I don't recommend you to go to beginner. I actually recommend you to start on easy mode. Um, so basically the way this works is there's going to be a timer here. And and depending on how you score, if you score anything like a minute 45 or, or uh, less than that, you'll, get, you'll uh, get first. If you score in two minutes, you get second. You score in three minutes, uh, two minutes, 15 seconds, you get third place. So basically, what you're going to be doing here is you're just going to be doing a regular edit course. You know, this is for beginners and stuff. You just want to do the simple. You just basically want to go straight. You, you, your job is to basically complete it. So it doesn't matter how you edit this. Your goal is to just go straight up. You got over here, you want to place the, the, the stairs. On some of them, you have to place floor, uh, wall and floor. But that that's completely fine. Um... Yeah, see, just like here, all you, all you want to do is just complete this map. That's it. That's that's all this is. Just completing the map. Oh, I I thought this was going down. Some of them you're gonna be going down rather than going up. I'm more. I don't normally play this map. I don't warm up. If you follow the Twitch, you know. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Bone Shack. But yeah, uh, little editing trick. Uh, trick is that if you play keyboard and mouse i highly recommend you to play scroll wheel that's actually the most common like that's i'm pretty sure that's like not even popularized anymore because it's just so like common everyone just does it uh that plays keyboard and mouse and if you don't uh, why like i i want to know if you play keyboard and mouse why do you not play on stretch rest okay so i beat this in a minute and 40 seconds which means i got first place Anything after a minute 45 would automatically be second place. So if I had a minute 46, that would be second place. Anything after two minutes is third place. And anything after two minutes 50 seconds, yeah, dude, you, you just, like, suck. All right? So I completed it in a minute 40 seconds pretty easily. Wow. Pretty easy. So now if you go over here, right? Now if you're like, okay, I know how to edit, but I'm just getting kind of uh, washed. right? I'm getting, kind of, I'm getting kind of scrappy at editing. So what you want to do here is... You want to try to play on Elite or Impossible. Um, and one thing I kind of wouldn't recommend. I mean, I haven't tried it out personally. So, like, I'm just avoiding this. But there's an aim course here. You don't have to do it if you don't want to. I mean, are the new weapons are even in this map? What's the new weapon? Um, yeah, there's the new weapons aren't even here. So, let, let's just avoid that. I don't think this map has been updated since forever. So, let's do number six, which is... Uh, impossible if you beat it in the two minutes 
and under two minutes you get first but you you get the you get the whole thing now so basically oh shit <laughs> i did not know how this was working okay oh damn yeah it's pretty like uh not hard but it's not as easy as the other map because now you're just like actually going crazy uh now see this is where you like place walls and floors everywhere Oh, I'm actually kind of scruffy at this too. Scruffy, wow, what a word. Good players do, but like, you know, I'm trash, so it doesn't matter. I beat in a minute 46, which means I still got first place. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. You know, you could just keep on restarting. Um, I think we click the remote. Oh. Oh, well, you could shoot one of these and it'll just t No? Wow, I've been lied to. Well, you, you know what to do, so... Yeah, and if you want to reset, I think you got to go over here, right, to this button, and then it just, okay, it, it'll restart the whole map, so, it's all good. If it doesn't, just restart the map, you're, now we're heading on to the lobby, god damn, bro, my, my background is sick. Okay, alright, next map we want to be doing is music. 1v1s and practice, now you can either put it as a public game, or you can put it as a private game. Um, you could actually do both because not only does it have public 1v1s, uh, if you play on private mode, there, there's actually practice maps on the, there's actually practice maps on the, uh, map. I, I don't know how that makes sense, but Marto's got it to work. Now, if you don't know who Marto's is, uh, like, actually, bro, that's insane. So... One thing I like about this map, it's pretty new, so there's like all the new weapons. There's also OG weapons here as well. There's even a Shadow Tracker pistol for some reason. Minis and Grappler, you know, just a typical. There's also... Well played. Clipped. Box like a fish. GG. Easy. Good luck. You are good. Nice shot. Come build fight. Touch grass. Be right back. See, like that's something cool. Like, I don't think anyone has ever done that. Uh, reset builds. You got chill vibe. Oh, and I was playing music. That's actually sick how that how they got that to work. So now there's gonna be music in the background. Like your head to wait, but no, so cause you're so empty. Okay. Uh I don't know if I'll get copyrighted. I mean I'm not even famous or anything, but like I still don't wanna see that. So this guy he's currently in peace control. But what we could do is we'll go over here to uh let's just say Ram Peak. Honestly, I never played this map, but I've heard that it's pretty good. So Oh yeah, so I think you just want to you just want to place uh, this here. Oh God, I'm actually mad bad at this. Yeah, see, it's, it's it's quite simple. Oh man, like you just yeah, that that's all you're doing over here. I'm actually like bad, so like it's all good. Yeah, so, it's pretty sick, but oh, jeez. Yeah, you know I'm like kind of trash at. Oh my, see this. I, this Yo, Marto, I don't know how you do this, bro, but, like, I'm kind of trash at this. Alright, see, that's cool. And then, I think you, oh, yeah, you go over here to leave. You also got practice pre-fire. I mean, this is pretty sick because all you got to do is just place build. And then start shooting you. And you got to, like, this and just place build. Like that. I don't know what the next one's going to be at. That's basically what practice is, Ryan. You kind of want to like shoot and place your build at the same time. Like, like before before they could break it. I'm not doing it right, but yeah, like like basically like that. So you're gonna shoot it, and you're like my job is to like shoot them right before the build breaks. But I'm actually like kind of shooting kind of early, so that's like bad. Like okay. you like shoot them. Like, they're shooting a first round, so it's kind of weird. Alright, so that's kind of sick. And then you can leave that too. I don't think I could join. I could join it. But I'm not going to join it because someone's peace control in there. If you want to go back to the build fights, you go either shoot here, shoot there, or shoot right there. I'm going to be real with you. If you want to listen to the music, you could. I'm not a huge fan of like lo-fi type beats or whatever i maybe one day i'll make a video and i'll just have like the beats like playing in the background like no commentary type stuff but i honestly don't listen to it in general so like 
I'm not gonna listen to it. So th those are two pretty good maps that I just showed. You can practice your aiming, you can practice your editing, you can practice your ones, you can practice your pre fires, your pre builds, your a lot of good stuff in this one map. You can learn a lot, and a lot of people actually play this as well. It's pretty popular. It was from this guy named Martos. I don't know why I said this guy. You guys probably know Martos. Uh, so now what you want to do is you can either play 1v1 realistics or you could do uh, 32 player zone wars. You know, this is a nice map. You could even do 32 player duo zone wars. See, these are actually in my recently played. Some of these maps like Tilted Tower zone wars and stuff and red versus blue. I don't, don't worry about those. Those, those are not for competitive reasons. But uh, if I go to uh, compete, right? Most tournaments are a duo tournaments, so I don't know if this is gonna change in the future or anything. I don't really like, like watch it. I just see like, oh look, this is a tournament and I play it. So I'm not 100% sure whether or not every single tournament is gonna be duos or solos. But as you can see, most of them are duo tournaments. See, Bill Cup duo. See, most of them are duos. Uh, there's no more solo tournaments, so so you could play. Um, what is the map? Where was the map at? This one right here. Duo Zone Wars. I'm going to be real with you. This map, I love it and hate it at the same time. Because, one, it's, it's kind of laggy. Like, not lag like, like oh, you're going to, like, lag. Like, 300 ping consist. No. You, you get lag spikes. And, like, it actually makes it seem like it's a real, like, end game. Because... I remember, like, I was playing this one end game. You know, you got to follow the Twitch, twitch.tv slash bro. I'm Shaq. Uh, link in the description. Uh, when I used to, when I played, I was in Clix's lobby and Acorn's lobby. Um, and Faze, I think his name was, like, Epic Will. I think that was Clix's partner. And then Agent Cold. I actually don't even know these guys. I, some random person in the Twitch actually told me that they were in my lobby. And I just had to, like, pop up in Clix's stream to see. And I actually was in his lobby, and I have screenshot proof. Um, it's it's on my YouTube thing. So, um, yeah. So, uh, when I was playing it, it felt super laggy. Not like lag spike laggy, but like, you know, it's like the game can't read what you're doing. I'm like, I shot this kid, right? I knocked him, but the kid was still like running in place before he got knocked. So, it's like, it's, it's like really laggy. Building is like... It's kind of so, so that's why I like it. it. It works great. And then if you want to play solos, you got this one right here. This 32 player zone wars. It's basically like the first one, but it's solos. So uh, you could practice by yourself. Um, but yeah, that's basically it for the creative map. Now the best way I get like better is I just play the game. Like I honestly don't even spend that much time in com in creative. Uh, like people who actually do that like cheers to you like people that got aim trainers and all that cheers to you like i i can't do that for a long period of i get bored instantly i think that's a waste of my time so we're just gonna hop into one straight game i'm gonna just show you like how i play i guess i mean it doesn't really matter like i kind of just showed you everything you need to know so like if you want to click off that's fine but if you want to watch me play i appreciate it um this video is not sponsored by anything unfortunately uh Oh, 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 oh. Why the bus look like that? Why the bus looking like that? Why it looking like that? Oh, see, that's fake. The bus not even green on the side. Alright, so we gotta land at the best landing spot in the world. AKA hey, Breakwater Bay. Uh, if you don't land here, uh, thank you. Uh, I don't need people landing here because I'm trash, but we're gonna land here. I think the best way to land at breakwater is by landing there with your glider. But um, sometimes when my landing is too low, I land over there. I call it my house because it is my house. Yo, I'm, bruh, like low key, I want this video to get like a million to billion views so like they can write down Shaq house. Like just have a friend that says Shaq house. Like, that'd be sick. Imagine, like, imagine they still have like that landmark thing. So if you enter a certain landmark, it'd be like, you've entered it, bruh. Imagine that you enter Shaq's house. Oh my. Yo, y'all gotta do that for me, chat. Like, I don't know why I'm wearing this combo. I'm not good. I'm not trying hard or nothing. I'm trash. But, yo, that'd be sick, bro. Imagine, like, you've entered Shaq's house. Oh, that'd be crazy. That little hut plus that house. That's my house, bro. But I'm going to land here for now. <coughs> All right. Now, over here, I land on this side. One of the most beautiful houses I've ever put in the right there. 
All right, that's one AR tap. All right, I didn't get the kill or anything. That's fine. Damn, that's fine. Um. Oh yeah, never, never equipped in this, bro. Every time I try to use it, it doesn't shoot when I charge it, but then it just like explodes in my face. So I'm not using that. That thing is trash. All right, so we're gonna go over here. This is my loot path. I loop this house up, and then I loop this little area up. Right after I loot up this little area, I go right here. I break this chest, uh, but there's no chest. That's fine. Give me the lever. Go here. Give me the havoc. Break this. Get this. Waiting to get my mammoth pistol that I'm obviously never gonna see, but that's fine. All right, got the MK. Then I go right here, and then I get yeah, just just like that. I get that as well. Actually, I'm gonna rock the pistol, or no, nah, I'm gonna rock the SMG. The pistol does way more damage, but. The, the SMG shoots way more faster, so you gotta like take your chances sometimes. I already have the AR, so no need for the SMG. Whoops, I thought it broke. Okay. Yeah, pretty pretty good landing spot. I already looted up a bunch of chests. Didn't get good loot. Uh, now perks. Um, I'm gonna be real with you. I'm not gonna try to spend a bunch of gold. Um. Because I really don't have any. I, and I honestly don't care about gold. So like. You can just keep on re-rolling. If you want. This is this this is like. Not competitive. So. Let's go over here. Oh yeah. Get a slap effect real quick. Get this. Get this. Got a key. That's fine. Smack on big plots and all that. Let's go over here real quick. Get one of these and tell you where the nearest player is. And then we get this. Was this the person that I was shooting midair or no? Okay, where's the guy at? He's over here, right? This guy could be anywhere, but I'm pretty sure he's gonna be like most of the time from what I've seen with the bounties is that they're actually like all the way over here like they're like basically opposite towards you most of the time unless it's like oh shit <laughs> yo that doesn't scare the shit out of me bro <laughs> okay now i don't know what color loot this would give but we got okay yeah i, I had a feeling it's gonna be blue um Honestly, I'm dropping the big for this. I know, kind of dumb, but at the same time, I'm not here. Um, mats aren't the greatest, but that's because like I'm not I'm not looting up like that. You could break a bunch of fences here, get a lot of good loot. It'll be sick. A little cool thing if you could get like if you could get like a different color, like okay. So he's, he's, he's over here somewhere, so that's fine. So I think we got ourselves Aquatic Warrior, so I think our, like, I think we'll be safe on... Okay. What if there's a perk where you can swim faster or move faster in, uh, like, traversal items? Not like cars, but like vines and all that, you just move, like, you just tend to move faster. So now let's give ourselves Mud Warrior, this is a pretty good perk. A pretty OP perk that would go along with it would be the one where would be the perk where you can get um uh what's it called the perk where you could get uh mud from bushes that would be that would go pretty sick with your perk um I don't know where this guy could be I mean he was nearby on the map I'm assuming that he is like I'm assuming that he's in here. Yep. I'm gonna just straight up walk up to him.
Yep, I, I should not have taken damage there, but it is what it is. I mean, I saw him at first, but then it was like, it was like weird. -ish. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. But since I'm not a controller player, I'm not going to pick up the flapjack for now. I'll pick it up at another time in another dimension, I guess. But in the meantime, what we're going to do is we're going to go right here. So someone captured the flag. that like didn't work for me but oh he has my pistol thank you yeah pretty pretty effective crouch maneuver um pretty nice like i i had a feeling he was gonna do that so i just had to hit the little crouch like once i saw that he had the wall crouch it, i don't know crouching it's it's real effective sometimes you know easy end the fight um oh wow I didn't know that doing that would do that, but okay, we'll do that. Alright, so now we just want to run it. The whole time we want to run. Um, damn, what are these parts? Uh, pistol recycle. This is a pretty good part because you have a chance of not needing to reload your gun. And I think that's sick. And if you don't need to reload your gun, then like, damn. <laughs> It's just automatic, so you go like boom, you just wait like one second and go like boom, because it's like, it's like half a reload basically, because there is, I think, a cooldown, don't take my word for it, because like if you die and then y'all gonna be like, oh, uh, it should have cool, it should, it didn't have a cooldown, or it had a long cooldown, I'm sorry bro, I don't know how it works bro, you just shoot it and there's like a chance it doesn't shoot, I think if you, I think if you, I don't know if you hit or miss your shot, but, that's on you. Now, I honestly rock the mammoth pistol because I'm pretty good with it. Um, like you, you'll see, you'll see later on what I'm talking about. But oh my gosh, this game just want me to win. All right, that's fine. So now what we want to do now that we're here, um, like earlier from the perks, what we want to do is we want to get the mud effect. Now, if we get the mud effect, we will um, be chilling because. With the mud effect, you know, you get here. Oh, wait, wait, I have aquatic warrior too, so I get healed with the water. Okay, I forgot about that. See, it's good to know your perks. You also don't. You also don't. Yo! You also don't even need, like, like, you also don't need to. Yo, he invites me one more time, bro. I Don't you dare, don't you dare invite me again, bro. If I see one more invite coming out of this guy, bro. Oh, damn. Okay, so these are, these are the slabs. Oh, these are the exotic ones. Ah, uh, the exotic ones, I think it heals you faster. Um, I think it gives like a, I think it gives double of what the original one that gives. And I think the original one gives like 15. So like, getting 30 is actually crazy. Um... Alright, let's do my second pick. It could be heavy headshot. Scope Salvo, I, I've actually never used this, but let's let's give it a try. You know, you, you always gotta try something new. So let, let's try it out. Let's see how it works. Um, oh yeah, these things right here, you break it, they'll give you 25 health each. Okay. He's weak. Oh, I forgot I had the pistol on me. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I kind of forgot I had that. Okay, yeah, so the pistol... So the AR does sl shoot slightly slower. That's fine, though. Uh, not slightly. It actually shoots at, like, half the rate. So uh, that's kind of crazy. Okay, that's fine, but... Oh, jeez, that's actually insane. That rate of fire is crazy. Okay, but we, we gotta get to zone now. I'm actually just wasting chug splashes at this point. Oh, I can get up there. That's fine, though.
Oh. That didn't work, but that's fine, that's fine. 20 other players. Pretty decent. Oh, I missed a shot. Damn. Okay. Now, the thing, though, with the Mammoth Pistol, you need precise aim. Oh, I shot that. I shot that. Oh, damn. Okay, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bro. Oh, up there is actually some. I mean, down here is actually some, two of these. So we're gonna pop both of these. Get our mats. I'm gonna wander off in the distance. I actually don't even need to fight that guy. Um, one thing that I kind of found out, um, I think a friend told me, is that if you, if there's people in your lobby and you kill them and they have like a way higher like rank than you. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm actually like insane. I'm not gonna carry the med kit. I'm actually gonna carry the explosive repeater. Alright. Oh. Why the hell did that even happen? Okay. Okay. I tagged him. I got tagged in the process, but that's fine. Pretty risky fighting this guy. The 50 50 chance. Do he have heals? Ah, oh, he's wasting all of his heals. Okay. Reset is crazy. No reset is actually crazy. Yeah, I also like like look at the frames. Like it, it gets worse the more I looked over there. Heels. I don't know what I was doing when I was playing, but that's I. I lost. I you don't get to see your results. I think I had like twenty something percent. Um, I didn't really play that good. Why was the switch kid inviting me to party though? <laughs> I don't know why I said that. He didn't even invite me until like before the fight. But I went down in percent. Let's actually join this kid, and I can't join the party. Okay, let's request to join. Let's see, let's see who this is. I'm gonna be like what what. Word the, the whole time. If he doesn't, if, if he doesn't invite me in like two seconds, bro, I'm actually gonna be mad. Yeah. Ah, yeah, he's getting unadded. So yeah, if you guys slightly enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe. I'll see y'all later. Peace.